right, it's that time of the year. Pants off and we're gonna start cutting my pants because it's hot. Alright. There we are. It's good now. All right, so we got Terrence here installing a X pipe on his uh, Ford Galaxy. This thing's got a 460 Ford motor in it. I know, I know, Ford. All right, so I'm making the, um, the battery cable, which uh, paths Trans Am, it's pretty easy. Strip it, put the thing in the vise, fill it with solder, slam it in, heat shrink it, it's pretty easy. All right, so the battery cable is made. We only got one side. The other side uses just like a regular uh, battery terminal. So we're not making that side yet. We're gonna put the starter on. Starter side on first, but it's easy. Like I said, you literally just heat the yeah. crap out of it, fill it with solder, jam it in, and put some heat shrink on it. And that's what it looks like. I mean, yeah, I could use a little more heat shrink, but it looks mint, so who cares? All right, now we're making the power wire for the distribution block. And this is a four gauge, and it's the same exact process. It's easy. Right, now that one is made. Uh oh. Same process. Heat it, solder it, push it in, heat shrink. There we go. We'll take that. We're ready to get put on the car and then we gotta measure it and do the other side. So now, a long day and a half working on their cars. Now, I'm here at the shop, working on the GTO. Now, what's going on with this thing <clears throat> is a lot, you know? It's supposed to be done like a month ago. Hasn't been done yet. But no, I'm right now taking out the seat so we can put this carpet in. Blow the interior out. You know, zip tie some wires up, tighten up the shifter because it keeps getting loosey goosey on me, you know what I mean? So, yeah, we're gonna take these seats out, it's pretty easy. Just take out the bolts from under there, under the floor, slap that carpet in, put the seats back on. I got some lap belts that I'm gonna think about putting in. Probably won't put them in because you don't need them. So, yeah, here we go. So I got the back seats in. Yeah, it's a pretty big pain in the you know what. But got the back seats in. Yeah, headline ripped over there. My friend Pat did that. Freaking guy, man. Can't trust him with anything. So now we're gonna get these seats both down under there. Tie up some wires. Put these things on. You know those things. I don't know what they're called. You know what I mean. Here we go.
Okay, you're probably wondering what the hell is this going on. So it's all on the Vice Group Garage. Um, so basically what I did is I'm pulling down the front of the car. I'm going to heat up the springs and hopefully it lowers it. I have two inch lowering springs, but two inches too low. And I just bought factory height. And I don't want to buy a third pair of springs to lower it one inch. So I'm going to see if this works. I'm going to see if this B tank can get it hot enough. You might need like an acetylene torch or whatever. I'm not a welder or a fabrication guy, but we're going to see if this works. So here we go. Okay, so we're at a local park and some kid wanted to have a pull contest with Pat's diesel right here. So we're gonna hook him up. We got the clapped out Jeep. So we're gonna hook up, we're gonna hook it up and see who wins. We're gonna do two wheel first and we're gonna do four wheel after the two wheel. Yeah. 